Next topic grouped frequency distribution table. A group data could be of two types are below. First a continuous discontinuous frequency distribution and continuous frequency distribution table. Okay. Class interval level example eleven to twenty, twenty-one to thirty, thirty-one to forty. Okay. Here in this class interval 11 to 20 and 21 to 30. First class interval 11 to 20. What is the upper limit? 20. 20 is the upper limit. Okay. What is the lower limit of this class interval? 21. These two numbers are same? No. Not same. That means this type of class interval, this type of frequency distributions are called what? Discontinuous frequency distribution. Okay. Next continuous frequency distribution means what? Continuous frequency distribution, for example, 0 to 10, 10 to 20, 20 to 30. Here, these two lower upper limit and lower limit of the consecutive classes are same. Here, upper limit and lower limit of the consecutive classes are not, class intervals are not same. Okay, this 30 and 31. Here, 10 and 10, both are same. Here, 20 and 20, both are same. Okay, but in this class interval 30, here 31, different. But this is a discontinuous class uh, frequency distribution. This is a continuous frequency distribution. First one example, here total number of students is 38 in this class. Collect this, uh, one data about it, the weights. Okay, here 31 to 35, 9 students. 36 to 45 students, 41 to 45, 14 students and so on. Total number 38. Here 9, 5, 14, 3, 1, 2 are what frequencies. Okay, frequency means what number of times occur in this table. Okay, how many times you are 9 students are in this 31 to 35. That is uh, some numbers in between 31 and 35, 9 students are there. That means uh, the number of times occur okay 31 to 35 is what 9 that 9 is called a frequency okay here 31 to 35 36 to 40 in this class two new students joined the weights is 30.5 and 40.5 okay 30.5 kilogram and 40.5 kilogram how can you add this weight into this class interval? Can you add this to weight in this class interval? How can you add this? We can add this. We, we have to change this what order. Okay, how can you change its order? This is a discontinuous class interval. Change into continuous class interval. How can you change into cl continuous class interval? Okay, first uh, consider two consecutive class interval. Okay, for example, 41 to 45 and 46 to 50. Okay, consider, consider these two class interval, 41 to 45 and 46 to 50. What is the upper limit of this class interval, 45? Okay, upper limit. equal to 45. What is the lower limit of this class interval? Lower limit equal to 46. What is the difference between these two numbers? Difference. Difference is equal to 46 minus 45 equal to 1. What is the half of this difference? Half of this difference equal to 1 by 2 equal to 0 0.5. Then how can you change this class interval? Here this 0 0.5, half of the difference is 0 0.5. This 0 0.5 subtract the lower limit and add to upper limit. What is the new class interval? New class interval equal to new class interval is equal to 31 minus 0 0.5 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 31
31 minus 0 0.5? 30.5. 30.5. 35.5. This class interval become what is it? 30.5 to 35.5. Here, how can you change into this new interval, new class interval? All the all the lower limits 31. Sorry. All the lower limits 31, 36, 41, 46, 51, 56, and so on. These lower limits subtract 0.5. Okay, subtract 0 0.5 from the lower limits and add to 0 uh, what upper limits 0 0.5 add to upper limits you will get new class interval. Okay, for 30.5 35.5 instead of 31 to 35 you should write a 30.5 and 35.5. What is the next class interval 36 minus 0 0.5 that means what 35.5 to 40 plus 0.5, 40.5. Okay, next class interval 41 minus 0.5, that is equal to what? 40.5 to next 45 plus 0.5, 45.5. Okay, this is a continuous class interval. Then this in class interval becomes the new class interval becomes. 31 th sorry 30.5 to 31.5 next year 30 35.5 35.5 to 40.5 next year 40.5 to 45.5 45.5 to 46 sorry 50.50.5 and so on okay clear then you can include that two new students in this group 30.5 30, 30 you can include the first interval class interval 40.5 you can include this second class interval okay then you, you can continue the same manner okay Next exercise 14.2 the relative humidity in percentage of a certain city for a month of 30 days was as follows 98.1, 98.6, 99.2 some percentage already given in this table. Okay, Construct a grouped frequency distribution table with the classes 84 to 86, 86 to 88 etc. This data is not a group data, this is an ungrouped data, you should write in a meaningful manner. Okay, then how can you write in, you already given the class interval 84 to 86, 86 to 88 etc. Okay, next uh, second question, which month or season do you think this data is about? We can't write the di answer directly, first you write in a group wise that means group distribution table ok then you can write the answer very easily ok what is the range of this data this one also you can write it ok here first we relative humidity percentage next to tally marks frequency okay first class 84 to 86 next year class 86 to 88 next one 88 to 90 next year 90 to 92 92 to 94 94 to 96 96 to 98 
98.1 here before that 86 kilogram not included in this first class interval 86 kilogram included in the second class interval okay here first one 98.1 98.1 which class interval 98 is not included this class interval 98.1 included this class interval okay 98 98.6 98.6 also included in this class interval 99.2 99.2 next 90.3 90.3 90 means work. here 90 is there 90 all here also there but 90 90 and 90.3 not included in this class interval 90 and 90.3 included this class interval so can write it that 90.3 next 86.5 86 to 88 here 86.5 okay next in 95.3 95.3 in this class interval 95.3 next year 92.9 92.9 where 92 is there but you should consider not including this class interval 92.9 in this class interval 96.3 96.3 this class interval 89.2 89.2 this class interval 92.3 92.3 okay 97.1 97.1 okay 93.5 93.5 92.7 92 92.7 this class interval next day 95.1 95.1 next day 97.2 97.2 next day 93.3 93.3 should write it there 96.2 96.2 next day 92.1 92.1 next day 84.9 84.9 okay 90.2 90 90.2 95.7 95.7 98.3 98.3 97.3 97.3 96.1 Next ninety four point two. Okay, ninety five point two. Ninety two point one. Ninety five point one. Ninety seven point three. Ninety seven point three. Eighty nine. Eighty nine. What is the frequency? How many times are here? 1. Frequency is 1. How many times 86 to 88? Only 1. 88 to 90? 2. 2. Next year? 7. 6. 7. 4. How many days are there? 1 plus 1, 2. 2 plus 2, 4. 4 plus 2, 6. 6 plus 7 13 13 plus 6 19 19 plus 6 26 26 plus 4 30 30 days which month or season do you think this data is about here uh, humidity is quite high that means what this is a rainy season okay but second answer rainy season what is the range of this data here range means what highest observation minus the difference between the highest observation and lowest observation what is the highest observation highest observation is 99.2 and lowest observation is what 84.9 you can calculate 99.2 minus 84.9 okay here 
और से सेवन फिफ्टीन पॉइंट सेवन व्हाट इज द रेंज ऑफ दिस डाटा द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द हाईएस्ट ऑब्जर्वेशन एंड लोवेस्ट ऑब्जर्वेशन व्हाट इज द हाईएस्ट ऑब्जर्वेशन नाइंटी नाइन पॉइंट टू व्हाट इज द लोवेस्ट ऑब्जर्वेशन एटी फोर पॉइंट नाइन ओके क्लियर what is the difference between these two observations then third three and next eight eight minus four a range equal to fourteen point three okay the highest observation minus lowest observation next uh, question number one the blood groups of thirty students of class eight are recorded as follows A B O O A B etc. Okay, represent this data in the form of a frequency distribution table. Which is the most common and which is the rarest blood group among these students? Blood group. Tally marks. Frequency. O A B, A B, four groups. Okay. Same thing. Tally marks. First A, A. Next A B. Next A O O. Next A A B. Next A O. A. Next A O. B A O B A next year O O A A B O A A O O sorry A B A B next year B next year A Next year O B A B A. Next year B O. Frequency. This is twelve, nine, six, three. How many students? Thirty students. Twelve plus nine, twenty-one. Twenty-one plus six, twenty-seven. Twenty-seven plus three, thirty. Total, thirty. Question: Which is the most common and which is the rarest blood group among these students? Which is the most common? Frequency is twelve is the greatest number. Then this is the what most common group? That is O is the most common group. What is the rarest group? Only three people are there. That means what? Oh, sorry, uh, students are there. Only three students have A B group. That means this is a rarest group. Okay, blood group. Okay. Then answer, which is the most common? O is the most common group. What is the rarest blood group? A B is the rarest blood group. Homework. Fourteen point two exercise question number two four five.